live at 11. Tonight, she says that she is sorry for slamming her RV right into a North Las Vegas casino. Thanks for joining us, everyone. I'm Todd Quinones. And I'm Trisha Keen. The crash left a casino working, fighting for his life. 13 investigative reporter Joe Bartels is live at the Cannery Casino in North Las Vegas. And Joe, she says this crash wasn't her fault. Yeah, Todd Trisha, she claims it wasn't. She claims that she was owed some sort of money from the casino and that she was in some sort of dispute with casino workers just before her motorhome went crashing through the front doors here at the cannery and pinned an employee underneath it in the process. I don't know that. So he's in critical condition? That's what they're, they're telling us. He's still um, recovering from what happened. And with that, Jennifer Stitt, who goes by the nickname Jordan, expressed remorse for the scene she admits she caused at a North Las Vegas casino last Friday morning, but says it was an accident. I'm innocent. I didn't. I haven't done anything. I, I, I was to the point where I was lightheaded and I accidentally ran into the cannery. I didn't mean to hurt anybody. I'm not a homicidal person. I wasn't violent about it. Police say the scene and surveillance video showed otherwise at the cannery. This police report obtained by 13 Investigates reveals surveillance video showed a casino worker cleaning a breezeway when Stitt's RV crashed through the glass entrance and the victim was pinned with his back against the front of the motorhome. I was um, under a lot of pressure. And um, I think propane or something was leaking in my um, RV. I, I, it must have went to my head. I was feeling dizzy. I don't know what happened. I just got to that, that state. The same report goes on to say on the same surveillance camera, nine seconds later, the motorhome is seen accelerating forward about another 10 feet. The victim disappears under the motorhome before security pulled him to safety. It's terrible. I didn't see anybody in the way, but no, there's no... I feel, I feel really remorseful for what I've done. Stitt says she was in a dispute with the casino for a few hundred dollars that she thought she was owed. She had been thrown out of the casino and trespassed from coming back, but claims she didn't intend to drive into the casino. Do you regret what happened? Yes, I do. I regret it. I'm just asking for help for the family that the guy I ran over. I feel really bad. I regret it really bad. Police say the casino worker had serious injuries. Stitt was arrested for attempted murder and battery. She says she served time in prison for money crimes in the past. She's due to appear before a judge later this month. And Stitt, get this, is calling for the casino to pay for the employee's medical bills. Now, we did ask the North Las Vegas Police Department as well as the cannery for the surveillance video from this incident. Both say that is part of the investigation right now and they will not be releasing it at this time. Reporting live, Joe Bartels, 13 Action News.